stops in three, two, one. Hello, American Rod Shop family. Welcome in to the part two of the big 30,000 subscriber giveaway event and where tonight's episode, we will announce the winners of each one of the prizes. Now, if you will, if you want to, go ahead and get you a pen and paper handy to write down your prize number should your name pop up after that prize. Now, these will be shipped to you totally free, won't cost you a dime. And I'll give information on how to receive your prize totally free throughout the video several times so you'll get an option of knowing how to do that. Now, this video is not very long tonight. We're going to get in and get out and everybody find out what they won and who the winners are. So let's go ahead and get started with prize number one. Now, this is actually prizes one, two, and three. And each one of these are a 1966 original tag. And I want to say I appreciate GDP. That's me for donating these tags for the giveaway. That is very kind and generous of them. For prize number one, this one is going to be Stephen Fulton 1563 is the winner. Stephen Fulton 1563. You have won prize number one, one of these tags. For prize number two, one of the tags also is Mr. Frogman 54. Mr. Frogman 54 is the winner of tag prize number two. And prize number three is won by Curious Gornell Fan. Curious Gornell Fan is the winner of prize number three, which is another 1966 tag. Number four prize is a 124 scale die cast. 1957 Chevy pickup. This was won by Miss T. Stang. Miss T. Stang, you're the winner for this one. Number five prize is this George Barris Custom Rickshaw Hot Rod Model Kit. And this was won by Mike Spretzer 382. Mike Spretzer 382 is the winner of the George Barris Rickshaw Model. Okay, let me pause again to let you know how to receive your totally free prize if you're one of the winners tonight. First of all, please allow up to two weeks for delivery. I've got 30 of these prizes to ship out, and it might take me a little bit of time. You need to contact me to let me know that you're the winner within seven days. Contact me at AmericanRodShop at Yahoo.com, and then in the email, put in the prize number that you won in the title of the email. And then inside the email, put a good mailing ship to address that you want your prize sent to. It doesn't matter if it's overseas or if it's in America or Canada, anywhere like that. I'll ship it worldwide. Just let me know a good ship to mailing address. And I will repeat these instructions a little bit later on, a few more times in the video, just to make sure everybody's got down how to receive their prize. Prize number six is another great George Barris creation. This is the Barris T-Buggy model kit, brand new sealed. And the winner of this one is Dude Adventures 4936. Dude Adventures 4936 is the winner. Okay, prize number seven is an AMT 32 Ford model kit. This one was won by Bob Day. QU7YL. Congratulations, Bob. You're the winner of prize number seven. Okay, prize number eight is the American Graffiti Soundtrack Record Album. Double album, actually. This one is won by Bill Shoemake248. Bill Shoemake248 is the winner of the American Graffiti Record Album. Prize number nine, which is a 3D sign called Drop a Gear and Disappear. Very sharp looking, about the size of a record album. The winner of this is Jason Jones, $22.99. Jason Jones, $22.99. You're the winner of prize number nine. Next up is prize number 10 and prize number 11. And each one is a 132 scale Batmobile that features a Batman figure in the display box with it as well. Now the winner of number 10 
is Frog Bones 1968. Frog Bones 1968 is the winner of prize number 10. And prize number 11 winner is DM McAllister 976. DM McAllister 976. You're the winner of prize number 11. Okay, let me stop right here and say that, again, if you're the winner of any prizes tonight, then you need to do these items in order to be able to receive your totally free prize. First of all, allow two weeks for delivery. And then you also have seven days to contact me now at AmericanRodShop at Yahoo.com. And then thirdly, you need to make sure that you put the prize number in the email's title. And in the email itself, in the body, put a good ship to address that you want your prize shipped to. I'll go over these again later on in the video. Okay, prize number 12 is this vintage style retro looking turtle wax display sign. It's metal. Looks great in your man cave. The winner of this sign is Mr. Nature Boy 2010. Mr. Nature Boy 2010, you're the winner of this prize number 12. Okay, prize number 13 is this 1950s blue ribbon penetrating oil can. And these are becoming highly collectible now. Everybody loves to collect cans and put them up in their man cave. The winner of this one is Kevin Call 8247. Kevin Call 8247, you're the winner of this prize number 13. Prize number 14 is the Mopar or No Car sign. It's metal, looks beautiful hanging on a wall. The winner of this one is Orion Bennett 776. Congratulations, Orion, you're the winner of prize number 14. And prize number 15 is another metal sign. This is Chevy Avenue. And the winner of this sign is Pappy 3100. Pappy 3100, you're the winner of the Chevy sign. Prize number 16 is this 750 piece wheels jigsaw puzzle. Brand new and it depicts the inside of a garage or a man cave. Now the winner of this one is Stoned Soup. Congratulations, Stone Soup. You've won this puzzle. Prize number 18. Prize number 17 is a vintage car craft magazine from either the late 60s or early 70s. This one was won by Kathleen Lawson, 1689. Kathleen Lawson, 1689. Prize number 18 is another car craft magazine from the 1960s or early 1970s. And this one was won by Lucy Hansen, 6250. Congratulations, Lucy, on your winning prize number 18. Prize number 19 is another vintage car craft magazine from the late 60s, maybe early 70s. This one was won by Resenda Zorman, 4645. Resenda Zorman, 4645, you won prize number 19. Prize number 20, the last of the four Carcraft Vintage Magazines from the 1960s. This one was won by Todd Smith, 4850. Congratulations, Todd Smith, 4850. Now, all these magazines will be shipped out bagged and boarded, which means they'll be able to display them very nicely on any shelf in any man cave or she shed. Prize number 21 is a very nice vintage Hot Wheels. I think that's a 49 Mercury Coupe. Been hot rodded. This one was won by Brenda Kramer, 6351. You've won prize number 21. Prize number 22 is another very nice vintage Hot Wheels called the Swing Fire. This one is won by Dan Wilder, 7016. Congratulations, Dan Wilder. You're the winner of prize number 22, and it is a nice little Hot Wheels. Prize number 23 is the Sharp Little Chevy 2 Gasser Hot Wheels. This one is won by Ron Ray Y40. Congratulations, Ron Ray Y40. Thank you for entering. You won prize number 23. Prize number 24 is this sharp little VW Bug Hot Wheels. This one was won by Runner Up 5.68. Runner Up 5.68 is the winner of this VW Hot Wheels. Prize number 25 is a 1959 Cadillac that's purple and it's a beautiful Hot Wheels. This one was won by Kelly Enright, 2578. Kelly Enright, 2578, you're the winner 
of the Hot Wheels prize number 25. Prize number 26 is this beautiful 1955 Chevy Nomad Hot Wheels car. Came out in 2023. These are pretty hot right now. If you can find one in any of the stores. The winner of this one is Agniska Mokzadlo. Agniska Mokzadlo, you're the winner of prize number 26. Number 27 prize is another Hot Wheels. This is a purple, I think it's a 32 Ford Vicky rat rod. This one is won by... Doug Fergia. Doug, you've won this Hot Wheels. It's prize number 27. Who doesn't like Southern Gospel music and hot rods? This, prize number 28, is a vintage record album from the Christian Ayers group and would look great hanging on any man cave or she shed. Makes a great display. John Stamos, 5579, is the winner. John Stamos, 5579, you're the winner. Of this vintage record album. Prize number 29 is this vintage new old stock thermal mug. You can put uh, cold beer in there or hot coffee. Now don't put them both though. It would be terrible. This is from the National Street Rod Association and the winner of this thermal mug is Tully on the Rocks. Congratulations Tully on the Rocks on winning prize number 29. And prize number 30, the one that everybody's been waiting on, the set of black fuzzy dice. Now, the winner of this is Don's HF Customs. And I know old Don has got plenty of cool cars that these dice can be hanging from on the mirror. Don, you're the winner of prize number 30. Okay, one more time. Here's how you can get your prize that you won tonight in the drawings if you're one of the winners. Please allow for two weeks for delivery. I'll try to get them out quicker if possible, but I got 32 to deliver, so it is going to be uh, probably two weeks on the average. You've got seven days to contact me after tonight's video at AmericanRodShop at Yahoo.com. Now, in that email, please put the prize number in the email title that you won and put a good mailing or ship to address that you want this prize shipped to. Okay, that's it, everybody. I told you it'd be pretty short. I want to thank each and every one of you for being a subscriber tonight was my way of kind of giving back to the community and to the family of all those out there in the American Rod Shop viewing audience. Thank you so much and may God bless each and every one of you. And I'll see you guys hopefully either Sunday night or Monday night in the next upcoming video.